What's going on, guys? This is Tax and Duty Free in Terminal 5 JFK. Thought I'd take a look at the whiskey they had. Right off the bat, the most interesting bottle they had was this Jim Beam Lineage. You'll see me focus up on it in a second. As far as I knew, this was a distillery only. And it's $250 at the distillery in Kentucky, plus tax, so it's about the same price. I did not know they had that in travel. Uh, as you see here, the lot in New York stuff, Eagle Rare, was way overpriced at $62. I know some people would think that's a good price. Now, on to the Hibiki Master Selects. I'm a fan of those, and I've happened to be lucky enough to have one of those from the past, so I passed on those. A Buffalo Trace, no great deal there. A lot of Jack Daniels products. And one I focused in on was the, and I hope I go back to it, they had the 100 proof single barrel travel exclusive. So we also picked one of those up. A very small Irish selection. I believe this Bushmill sherry finish might be the only thing that was unusual. And then we went into the scotch. A whole lot of regulars and a bunch of... There were a number of travel exclusives. Big ones that we picked up were the Glummarangis, the Accord, and the Elementa. We got into the Accord down in Mexico, and that was actually very fruity and tasty. Uh, they were running a sale at the time. This was a couple of weeks ago. Now, that was 25% off if you bought two bottles of Glenmorangie. A couple of the McAllen travel exclusives for huge dollars there. And here I'm just looking around the store trying to find any other whiskey. And really didn't find much.